finding the area of a rectangle using the area formula. We learned that area is the total number of unit squares that completely cover the space taken up by a plane figure. In this lesson, we want to learn a formula to quickly calculate the area of a rectangle when we know its length and width. Suppose we have a rectangle completely covered by four rows of eight unit squares without overlaps. We don't have to count the unit squares one by one. We have four equal rows, each containing eight unit squares. So the total is eight added to itself four times. Or four times eight. We can use the multiplication table to get the product. As you can see, the fourth row and eighth column intersect at the number 32. So the area of the rectangle equals 32 square units. We can make sure of our answer by counting the number of unit squares one by one. And we're right. 32 unit squares in total cover the rectangle. We can use these facts to make a formula for the area of a rectangle. We multiplied the number of rows by the number of columns to find the area. And since the number of rows and columns represent the sides of the rectangle, we can find the area of any rectangle by simply multiplying its length by its width. Let us test the formula. This is an 8 centimeters by 6 centimeters rectangle. What is its area? We calculate the product of 8 and 6. 8 times 6 equals 48. Area is measured in square units, and the unit used here is the centimeter. So the area of the rectangle is equal to 48 square centimeters. We can check if we are right by putting our rectangle on a square centimeter grid. Counting the total number of square centimeters that cover the rectangle without overlaps, we get 48 square centimeters. So our answer is correct. In this lesson, you learned about the formula for calculating the area of a rectangle.